I'm sure he's explaining nicely why they should leave us alone. Nicely. Sure. This fucking psychopath. The soundtrack of this show is fucking sick. I love it. And the red tent of everything. This whole sequence. I am in love. Look at that animation though. Look at that. Holy shit. One, two, three. Fuck it. Well, hello guys. Welcome back. I am Anna. And today we're going to be reacting to the second episode of Invincible. Before we begin today, do not forget to hit that like and subscribe buttons. And also remember that if you like my content and you want to support the channel, you can do it by becoming a patron. For just $1 per month, you will have access to full uncut reaction videos and movie reactions. If you like my content, you can also support me by buying me a coffee or making a one-time donation via PayPal. All of this is going to be in the description box down below. So it was quite a starter last episode, which was the very first one. Um, that choice of showing blood right at the end of it, I'm still a big fan of it. 10 out of 10. So let's jump into this episode and see what's gonna happen with Omniman because he massacred all of the other superheroes and I'm pretty sure that's a no-no for them as well, for that world. So let's see what's gonna happen here if anybody's even gonna know that it was him because he killed all of the witnesses, so... So let's jump into the episode and let's see if this can get any more bloodier. Oh, well, that's the guard from the Sorry. first episode. I mean, it's impressive. The queen might look like a nice old lady, but she comes from a long line of tyrants who all thought they were better than the rest of us. Dad! <laughs> you called me dad. Capping the neck now. Watch out. Sometimes it affects the spine. Oh! He probably got buried under a mountain again or something. <laughs> again. It's the Global Defense Agency. We have access oh, to Oh, she looks pissed as fuck. Who knows? Maybe someday we'll even work with. I know that every episode, the title gets bloatier and bloatier. Who did this? We have no idea. Not yet, anyway. But we'll find out. And when we do, they're gonna look a hell of a lot worse than your dad right over there. We're a little understaffed in the hero department. It's your moment, boy. Go be a hero. Okay, so you guys told me that he actually does have a logo which is supposed to be in the front of his suit, if they only show me the front. Holy shit, they remind me to the little merchants from Toy Story. Get away from those pe- Oh! Ooh. Oh shit! Oh my god! Oh, oh boy. I don't know what just happened, but I think I speak for everyone here when I say I never want it to happen ever again. He has so much Soka energy from Avatar The Last Airbender. Mark! I tried my best. You want to talk? I'll listen. You and Debbie need a lasagna? I make a good one. Actually, oh, I love him as a friend. I'm, um, uh, invincible. God, that sounds dumb when I say it like that. Sounds a little optimistic. <laughs> That's us, everyone's fourth favorite superhero team. Fourth? I like you guys way better than Fight Force. Oh, we're definitely I want to see them all of them. Those guys are the to throw up before every fight. Barf my guts out. Really? <laughs> like a fire hydrant. You'll get used to it. The fights, not the barfing. 
Thanks. I charge two fifty an hour. <laughs> hey, that's cheap. Cheaper than a psychologist. I don't know. I heard they were only everyone's fourth favorite. <sighs> Meet me out front after class, invincible. Nobody fucking see that. Do you know how many people died here yesterday? Three hundred and thirty-eight. Three hundred and thirty-eight. Oh, that's a lot. They ran off because, because they were dying of old age. Huh. Well, if they come back, maybe I'll just evacuate the area and wait till they get cancer. Wasn't hiding. Sir, who the Damien hell? Darkblood, demon detective. Demon detective. Sir, are you sure? Hey, you got a problem with a demon? Thought you were an atheist, Donald. <laughs> the theoretically. <laughs> theoretically. <laughs> Now I Apologies for Rex Blode. He's unbelievably awesome, incorrigible, and rude, and bored of this. Yeah, I mean, of course. Just text me, I guess. All right, you need my number. <laughs> it doesn't matter. She already has a boyfriend. So? You can be more awesome than him and take his place. That's how dating works. Why are you so intimidated by her? Other than she's amazing and you're kind of basic. <laughs> Thanks for that, William. I gotta go. Go? Go where? You know what? I don't care. I really like this character. You'll be alone forever. Is Mark dating Eve Wilkins? I wish. I wish. I, I mean, no. Definitely not. She's got a boyfriend. He is super available. You want his number? I'll write it down for you. Oh, what a great friend. <laughs> I love him. Oh, hey! Don't do that! She's so fucking awesome. That backfired so fast. Keep them off. Oh, that's cool. Way to go psycho there, Invincible. I take back everything I said about you before, and I said a lot. I don't know what happened. I got mad. I guess. Don't get me wrong. That was amazing. But also, the scariest thing I've ever seen. Just don't ever point that at me, okay? Don't listen. Oh no, that's fine. We'll handle the cleanup. Asshole! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's rude. Mark! Hey, son. He yeah. lived. Ow! Rip. He's so Careful! You're going what hospital did they move Maya to? No, uh, <laughs> oh. no, they they said she'd recover. Hey, I need my costume back. I don't care how torn up it is. It's classified, and I want it back. Go get it. Now. This bitch. <sighs> don't hit me where I am. Hit me where I am. <laughs> <laughs> Same guy. I fought here three years ago. No, I'm not the same guy. Well, sucks to be you then. Ah, my eye. My eye. <laughs> really? You tried this already. Hey. Are you using your time out? I get time out? Why do I get a time out? Hey, I didn't invent the rules. What rules? <laughs> All right. Um, I'm an evaluation officer for the Coalition of Planets. So I drop by little dirt balls like yours to make sure there's someone capable of defending them against, you know, planet conquering monsters, things of that nature. Well, I don't know what to tell you, man. Your planet signed up for the program. See? Request from Urath for evaluation. Urath? This is Earth! <laughs> Earth. Yes! Not Urath. No! That was an oh E. My God. E. Invincible. Oh, yeah? 
little optimistic, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I just bought you and I think you're quite invincible. Oh, this was genius. Wow. Oh, that's beautiful. Cool. I already told you everything I remember. Right. Someone thinks they're too clever for us. They all think that at first. This one knows what's up. He knows. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. What? Amber Bennett also wants to know if you'd like her number. What? Do you want Amber's phone number, nerd? Yes. Third time's a charm, right? Oh. We should consider the city lost. I will contact Cecil and suggest a nuclear response. What? No! The takes with him flying. I love them. Oh, let me guess. Daddy's okay, here. They're in so much trouble. Dad saved us from the Flaxons, but he went into one of their portals. Oh, so he'll be late for dinner? <laughs> I'm sure he's explaining nicely why they should leave us alone. Nicely. Sure. This fucking psychopath. The soundtrack of this show is fucking sick. I love it. And the red hand of everything. This whole sequence. I am in the love. Look at that animation though! Look at that. Holy shit. <clears throat> I love how they didn't pretend to be like a normal animated show anymore. They were like guts and blood from the beginning. I like that. <laughs> that whole gag of Invincible fighting that um, alien out there in the space and this being like a program that he thought this was the the correct planet it was not the correct planet that whole thing was genius that was hilarious <laughs> the best thing i've seen so far i do like i know the the answer to this is pretty obvious and out there but like why did omni omni man go out there and kill the league like that like why now like what's his plan, what's his angle? I know that he, right now he's the most, the, the, the strongest, most important superhero out there, right? So, yeah, but still, why, what, why did that happen now? He just goes psychopath from time to time, like his demeanor to some people. Last episode when he found out that his son gained his powers, and then here, because he was just awake half of the episode when he was um, demanding his suit back, the way that he speaks, the way that he behaves sometimes, it's just like so suspicious, you know? He's so entitled and it's understandable, but also, I don't know, there's just something that screams this is not a good guy, this is not an actual superhero. And this last sequence of him killing off an entire race of aliens, that was sick. He was, like, it was so badass, so great, the animation, the soundtrack, everything was just on point. It was the whole vibe. I loved it. I loved it. All of the choices in this show, I'm loving them. They're great. Well, this was it for today's video. I hope you like it. Tell me how you feel about this episode in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching with me. Have a great day and I will be seeing you around.